Welcome to Microscan's Machine Vision Lighting Training Series. We will begin with an introduction to machine vision lighting. One of the most important yet overlooked aspects of machine vision is illumination. In this introduction, we will cover the following aspects of lighting. The basic definition of machine vision lighting, lighting concepts, effective lighting and contrast, the elements involved in creating an image, lighting characteristics, creating contrast, and additional considerations to be taken in an inspection environment. Machine vision lighting is the component of a vision system that illuminates a part or feature to be inspected. Cameras do not actually see objects, they see light reflected from objects. Proper lighting is critical in creating accurate and reliable results. In this example, on the left, we see the result of uncontrolled ambient room light on a wrinkled piece of foil. Printed characters are barely visible in the image. On the right, we see how using a proper CDI illuminator creates superior contrast and an expiration date can be clearly seen on the foil. The basic elements needed to create an image are a camera, a part, and some type of illumination light source. Choosing a light source is dependent on your application and inspection environment. Illumination light sources can be anything from light emitting diodes or LEDs, fluorescent bulbs, incandescent fiber optics, or even sunlight in some applications. Microscan uses LEDs exclusively for reliable solid state performance that offers superior thermal manageability in both continuous and strobe applications. Variations in part features will dictate what type of illumination is required. The goal is to maximize contrast on desired features and minimize it on the rest of the image. Lack of feature contrast results in greater processing time and effort. In this example, on the left, we see how a ring light leads varying contrast throughout the image and does not create any contrast on feature edges. On the right, we see how a backlight provides consistent contrast throughout the image and feature edges are clearly defined. In these additional examples, on the left, we see the effect of improper lighting on three different parts. On the right, we see the effects of proper lighting. With proper lighting, the 2D data matrix, bulb filament, and engraving on metal can be clearly seen with high contrast. When creating contrast, changing the lighting geometry will affect the results. Both dark and light features should be considered in order to optimize contrast. Complex parts with challenging features may require a specialized lighting technique to create feature contrast. It's important to observe the effects of lighting on the part feature. In this example, we see how different colored parts can reflect different amounts of light back to the camera. These variations can sometimes be used to identify the color of a part in a black and white application. Be aware of ambient light in your inspection environment. Overhead lights or even stray sunlight can interfere with an inspection. In certain instances, light shields or baffle may be necessary to control the environment. In conclusion, Machine vision is 100% dependent upon lighting. Understanding lighting and making decisions early in the design phase of an inspection system will eliminate the potential risk of having to redesign a system later in development. 